Hey guys, what's up? This is Scooter here at Macintosh Tips. Today I got a great application for you. It's on the application called TuneUp. Uh, now TuneUp is great when it syncs with your iTunes music. Uh, now I know some of you guys don't buy your music. You use LimeWire, FrostWire, GitTube, import it from CDs, get it from a friend, uh, torrent it. You do a lot of things trying to find your music. But when you do that, you don't always get the bells and whistles. So when you download it off LimeWire, you're not always going to get the album artwork, the correct album name. So then when you're trying to use CoverFlow and impress your friends about it, uh, it doesn't really turn out as good because you don't have an image for it. You can always find the image by going off of Google or Amazon and finding the image, but that just takes up time. So with this application, it'll find all that for you. So basically, you just take your, uh, m your music that you don't have the album artwork for, the correct album name, drag it over to the application, it'll find it for you. This application does great. It finds concerts for you. It finds YouTube videos about the, mu about the song. Um, you just select it to play. The biography of the uh, artist at times, merchandise from the artist, things of that nature. Uh, so let me just go ahead and show you. This application is called TuneUp. Like I said, you see it right here on the right-hand side of... Um, of my iTunes player here. Now you can choose to have this on or off while iTunes is on. It's located in the menu bar and on the dock and I have it open to as soon as I open iTunes this opens. But in the preferences you can change all that. I'm not going to go through the preferences today uh, because they're pretty straightforward. You can check that out by yourself but the demo of it will be uh, very very much so needed and I think it'll definitely encourage you guys to go try out the trial. That's what I want you guys to do. Go after this video and check out the trial definitely. So, it's called TuneUp, like I said, and they're divided into categories. You have Cleans, Cover Artwork that is, that is Missing, Explore uh, Your World of Music, which is also called Tuneverse, and then Concert. So these four sections make up the application. Um, now, I have this song, Dick in the Box, great song, by The Lonely Island. As you see, I don't have, I have, don't have an album here, and I don't have an album cover. So basically, I'm just going to click on the Clean section. As you see, they're displayed here again at the top, and I can switch between them. Um, now... What I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and drag this song over into the clean section. So, drag, drop. Alright, it'll find it. Alright, I hit save all. Once it's done, and it should do it just like that. Boom. I've got the album, Incredibad. I've got the genre. I can go ahead and rate it myself if I want it to. And then I have the album artwork here. As you see, it found it for me. Didn't even have to go off of Amazon and do that. So I just drag, drop, and it cleans it all for me. So now when I play the song and you know and um, cover art or when cover flow, I can have that with me. Uh, now you will notice that you only have 100 cleans uh, as a trial version. So I only have I have 80 left to go, which is still a lot of cleans. Uh, but if you buy the application, you do have unlimited. So. Uh, cross your fingers that I actually get some codes to uh, share with you guys. Now, let's go into the next great option about this application, Cover Art. This will automatically find all the songs that have no album artwork, and it will find it for you. And all you have to do is just hit Save All, and it will find it. So as you see, I have some Dan Cook in here, some clips, some Chris Brown, things of that nature. Uh, and, it, and it finds this all for you. Uh, everything that's in their database, I should say. So it might not find the exact album, like for this Michael Jackson song, Bad. It didn't find the exact album, but it did find a, an album that Michael Jackson's song, Bad, was on. It was on the Bad album. It was on the History, Past, Present, and Future, Book 1 album. So it just finds uh, album artwork that the song is on. So but it's still very nice. And as again, it just really helps that cover flow look. And it's better than having nothing there. Um, Tuniverse. Basically, this finds out everything about the song. So let me go ahead and play a song here. I'm going to mute the volume so we don't uh, so we don't have any copyright here. But let's go ahead and find out something about Kanye West. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, play some Kanye West. All right, Kanye's playing. And as you see, TuneUp's kind of doing its thing over here. I'm going to go ahead and pause that. And as you see over here, it finds YouTube videos of the of the song. All right, on YouTube, so I can just play those right then and there. All right. It has a biography of of Kanye West, Quiz o Kanye Omari West. Boom, there it is, right there. Uh, I can tweet about all of this stuff. There are tickets, I guess, for his uh, for his song coming up with Lady Gaga. Um, there's merchandise of Kanye West merchandise, and then I can buy his music off eBay. So there's a lot of stuff I can do here in Tuniverse. So if I have an artist that I'm not really sure about, click on his name. TuneUp will find it for me. And the last thing I want to show you guys is concerts. Uh, when you first start up Tuniverse, it'll uh, ask for your location. And as you see in Memphis, Tennessee, there is a concert with Lenny Kravitz going on. I'm going to go ahead and change that. Let's see if I can have a better city here. Uh, Los Angeles, Angel, 
list, right? Los Angeles, fail at spelling. Uh, California and United States, save. And boom, there are a lot of concerts going on in LA right now. You've got, um, look at that, Sean Kingston, Jamie Foxx is coming up, Rob Thomas, Black Eyed Peas, R. Kelly. Look at that. If you live, if you live in LA, you're, you're lucky right now. So as you see, it just shows all the concerts right here and there. Um, so I might be making a trip out to LA. Who knows? Um, but this is Scooter Macintosh Tips. Uh, quick review of Tune Up, Tune Up, and just overview and demo. But this is a great application. I encourage you to go download it right now for free. Get your cleans going. Get the Tuneverse going. Find some cover art. The Beastly app, guys, comment below. Tell me what you thought. Um, I don't know what much more to say about this application that I love it. I really do like this application. It's a great app, um, and it's really, really accurate. Uh, I've had, uh, I have, I've tested it out with like Turkish songs, songs from Turkey that I, w I wouldn't think this would actually know about, and it's found it for me. So this is a great application, and uh, hopefully I might, I might purchase it, or I might just uh, contact the developer, get some codes going for you guys. Who knows? But uh, just a recap. Find your uh, album artwork and album songs, all the information about the song. Find the cover art, Tuniverse, find YouTube videos, merchandise, and biographies and concerts of your um, of your artists. And then concerts, find more concerts, I guess you could say, uh, of some of, your, of the guys in your local area. So this is Scooter Macintosh Tips. Hope you've enjoyed this application review. If you have any requests on applications uh, or any request videos, let me and EB, let EB and I know so we can get take that take care of that. And uh, don't forget, guys, the new MacintoshTips.com is coming. It is coming, guys. It's going to be a beastly website, and uh, I, I can't wait to launch this bad boy. Thank you for your support. Peace.